Uh, so my name is Enda Bates. Uh, I work in Trinity College Dublin in the Music and Media Technology program, uh, and I'm a composer of spatial music. Um, so this is uh, hence one of the reasons why uh, my exhibit here is uh, about spatial hearing, about how we hear sounds and tell where sounds are coming from. I'm part of a composer's collective called the Spatial Music Collective. And so we've been going for about two or three years now, uh, running gigs around Dublin uh, of all sorts of spatial music. So spatial music is really just music where the spatial location of sounds is a composed part of the work. So it could be eight loudspeakers around an audience and like spatial electronic sounds, or it could be a choir split into four groups that are positioned at the four corners of the room. So the exhibit here is called uh, Remote Ears Spatial Hearing. Uh, and the idea is, is that the microphone is placed in a different location from the headphones, which are positioned here in the cafe. And when people put on the headphones, uh, they are then hearing the sound from the position of where the head is. So essentially it is exactly as it says, it's remote ears. Uh, and you can hear different sounds walking around uh, from a distance far, far away from where you're currently located. Well, there's three different ways that we can tell uh, how, how we can hear spatially. Uh, and two of them are related to the fact that we have two ears that are on either side of our head. And the third one then has got to do with the shape of our ears. And using these three different uh, mechanisms, we can tell where a sound is coming from in space. And that's kind of the purpose of the microphone that's beside me here, the binaural head microphone. It's shaped like a head and it has uh, ears that are shaped, uh, accurately shaped ears. And so the whole idea is to mimic normal hearing and how everyday spatial hearing occurs. 